Shelter, a basic necessity of human life. What happens when this necessity becomes scarce? Students at Florida State University are struggling to find affordable and available housing, with some students camping outside for days in hopes to get a lease. A friend reached out to me saying she wanted to live with me, and I had bad news for her because they told me it's first come, first serve, meaning she would have to camp out um, to live here. Students like Sydney Levy feel helpless when it comes to the issue of student housing. I felt really bad for my friend. I brought them cookies and um, just let them use the bathroom and stuff. I just tried to support them as best as I could, but it was really hard on them. Shannon Staten, the executive director of University Housing at FSU, says that she does not see a major issue with housing on and near campus. There are plenty of beds out there for students to live. It's just depending on where the neighborhoods are, what the bus routes are, whether or not you have transportation, and how close you want to be to campus. While many FSU students are scrambling to find last minute housing, FSU is not the only university in Tallahassee whose students are impacted by this lack of availability. FAMU, which is up the street from us, had to close two residence halls right at the beginning of the term in the fall. There were 800 students that were trying to find housing at a time when some of our students who had not done it ahead of time were trying to find housing. Reporting for Seminole Showcase, I'm Ashley Jarman.